So one and done, Lamar Odom bringing it up for the Lakers. Turn around, and Kobe's on the board. One point game. So Kobe's the first basket of the game in general. But that's a good defense of us. Possession for the Lakers. They got after it. Kobe denied Foy and Lamar really working. And on Lamar, yeah. Lamar on the fall away is rewarded. Pants points. The Lakers lead the league in that category. Lamar inside the arc. Long two. And it's back to a 27 26. Lamar Odom back on the floor for the Lakers. Pat Gasol gets his first break of the game. And Lamar. Oh, boy. Stroke looks great. 40 35. But it's been a solid season on the dive. It's batted around. Kobe will keep it alive. Looked like a turnover, didn't it? Now Kobe the mismatch. Backing down Telfair. On the dive, it'll be Lamar Odom. Kobe went and he found him. 42-39. Second and uh, Randy Foy back on Kobe, so that's where the Lakers look to exploit again. The double chain. Lamar Odom lost it against Telfair. And Love with two fouls already. Wasn't going to try to get risky there. After the Lakers, who led by five, see themselves down by three in possession of the ball. As a result of a Laker mistake. Back door, Kobe. Finger rolls it home with a perfect lob by Lamar Odom. Laker great Elgin Baylor, and not far behind, Adrian Dantley now. Yeah, next on the list. Lamar, boy. Quick one. Quick trigger. Lamar Odom. And I bring that up because his last triple double came here at the force and baseline. Everybody else, or sideline, everybody else thought he was forced to the middle. Luke Walton spots up. Lamar Odom finds him. And another assist for LO. 74 70 Lakers. Comes the double. Kobe on the fall away. Won't get it. Short, real short. Kevin Love, despite the pressure, can't hold on to it. Lamar Odom just took it away. LO's got Kobe coming down the hole. And it'll be Lamar Odom on the slam. So they take it away from Love. And the quickness. But on the other end, after Lamar did a remarkable job of harassing Kevin Love into turning it over, then finds Kobe. This is the play right there. That either has to be a charge or a block. Too much contact for that to be anything other than that. It looked like his heel was on the line. Sasha looking for his first field goal attempt. The spacing, the ball movement on the run out. Sasha, beautiful pass to Lamar Odom, and a good to the line leading to the three-point play. Extra pass paid off. And Sasha with the flyby, gets into the paint, gives it up to Lamar, who gets a three-point opportunity. So, at least 17, the only starter out there. Critical time of the game for the Lakers. For the Lake and Lamar taps it, takes it away. That's the kind of activity he had in the first half. It'll be Lamar going to the line, looking for the three-point play. What a mistake. Balls in for the layup. Great job by Jordan. A double tap. Gets the ball into Lamar's hands. It's just the easiest shot Lamar will have. So Lamar looking for the three-point play. Man, he makes it a one-point game. Brooke leads out a seven to play. Kobe up against the smaller guy. And Carney came over and got it. Wow. Lamar okay. takes it away. And going to the free throw line. It's 45 in regulation. And Lamar on average. And comes through. Thing, too, because uh, Lamar has been, you know, as he talked about in a real nice place mentally. And it's freed him up to really do a lot of good things on the basketball floor. I'm not just talking about his rebounding, his aggressiveness on the offensive end as well. He's proud. Collins hits the gap. Kobe, the triple, real short. Lamar taps it home. The length of Lamar. It's been there all night. It continues in the fourth late with the pressure on. He taps it up and taps it in as Kobe's three is off the mark, but not Lamar's. And the Lakers had themselves a three-point advantage. Oh, that's scary because there are 20 seconds left to play. Seconds to play. Trying to force overtime. Up against Lamar Odom. The prayer, short. real short. And the Lakers survive a scare in Minneapolis.